Hi, I'm Daryl from Honey Demand here at Genetic uh, Leak Diagnostics. We have a situation where we've got water coming into the building behind me. Uh, we're gonna run through a couple different scenarios and where you should start with when you have issues like this. So first of all, it doesn't matter if it's commercial, doesn't matter if it's residential, a uh, home or business. If you got water coming in this area here and you have this kind of a soffit or overhang, there is no way it's related to this gutter because if that gutter overflows, it'll fall down, which is about four feet away from that wall. Water's not gonna defy all laws of gravity, creep up that roof and into the house. So it is not coming from the lower level. However, it may be coming from the upper level. This won't be from the gutter itself, but the gutter itself here will overflow. The water will hit the bottom roof here. It'll splatter all over the place, finding any kind of gaps there and work its way into the building. So the first thing you do is you start with cleaning this gutter and, and don't forget this, a lot of guys do, clean the downspouts. If there's any kind of clogs in either one of those pipelines, the water will back up and overflow. So gutter and downspouts. After that, if it hasn't resolved the problem, still continues to look at the next closest thing which would be this window directly above if the leak is here if it was here then it would be this window here so what we're gonna do is probably gonna caulk this window and then seal along the head wall flashing which is where this lower roof meets the house uh, and any screw heads that might be exposed that you have with metal roof you won't have that with a uh, with an asphalt roof you will have those nails in that head wall flashing so seal that and then see if that resolves the problems if that does not resolve the problems again we always start with the closest thing and work our way backwards we're now gonna work our way up to the upper roof and we're going to check to see if we have a leak in the valley here or anything along the edge here so we start with close thing there aren't going to be any big obvious holes if there were a leak every single time but if it's only leaking sometimes then it's not the other things that water can sometimes come from multiple areas so these may be contributing factors you could have water coming from like a gutter overflow a lower roof a window an upper roof and water from all three or four areas combined is enough to make it all the way into this house so just if you find one area and resolve it that may not be the only problem you have so you have to look at multiple areas all right so that's uh that's what we got going on here <laughs> i'm terrible from honey demand that's just a nice little educational piece of diagnostics that you may have if you have an issue at your house or on your business thanks for tuning in because sometimes it's not a gc you need it's a honeydew guy you need <laughs> take care like what you've seen click to subscribe now